Support and resistance levels are a major help for the technical analysis of the forex market with its vivid ups and downs of the prices. Any time when the price reverses at a point in a chart, a horizontal line can be drawn through it to mark a support or resistance level. I have demonstrated this by using arrows in this chart. Here the price goes down and up and is bounced off and goes down. The levels are called support levels if they stop a downward market move to continue as you can see there. There the market goes down and is stopped there at this support level and goes up. And they are called resistance levels if they stop an upward trend as can be seen there. It goes up, up, up and there's the resistance level where it breaks again and goes down. Depending on the direction of the price movement, support and resistance levels are basically the same and they are called support levels if the price approaches the levels from above and they are called resistance levels if the price approaches them from below. They are lines or levels through which the price cannot easily break through and if it does, it's a good sign for a strong force of the trend and probably a good entrance or exit point, as can be seen there. There's the breakthrough and then there is a strong force upwards. There's a high chance that a support level will become a new resistance level after breakthrough and vice versa. You can see this here for example. The price comes down, bounces off several times, has a breakthrough there, goes down, comes up, bounces off at the same level which was the support level but has become the resistance level now and then it goes up. The more often a trend bounces off at such a level and tests it, the more it is likely that a trend will bounce at this level in the future too.